Yeah. So, so what, uh, what did you take away from uh, just, uh, just kind of, I don't know, just figure out what I got to do better to, to, to be on the lineups, I guess. And, and, um, just be a better player overall. Before the break, you were on that line with Jackson Carter. I think that was, uh, you had seven shots on goal this game. Were you frustrated with those attempts? Yeah, well, obviously I was frustrated because I had a lot of chances, didn't score, uh, but it is the way it is. And uh, obviously the COVID break and uh, stuff like that, it just kind of pushed me down. And now uh, I had a good practices and good workout. So I just feel way better. I don't know, just uh, keep shooting, I think, and, and uh, just hit the spots where the goalie isn't, I guess, and just uh, keep believing. And I think, and I hope that uh, it's going it's going in at some point. What's the balance? I mean, I know you guys had so much time on the team and had to turn to some things and some other players, but the team seemed to have figured it out. But you seem like you guys had a balance and kind of lack it. Do you still maybe fight every now and then, but also know you have to do something different? Yeah, I didn't have many shots from that point uh, uh, so far, but uh, just got to, I don't know, either fake the shot and pass it back or uh, just try to find a way to, to get it uh, through the defenseman and uh, put it on a. Uh, I was uh, working out and uh, watching the guys uh, guys playing. Yeah. Hey, Philip, you? Alex? Yep, nice to go to Ted Colfin. Hey, Philip, when the coaches told you, were you surprised or disappointed when they told you you weren't going to play? Uh, well, yeah, I mean, I was disappointed for sure, and uh, I was pissed, but uh, now I feel better than I felt, uh, I don't know, a week ago when we played those games. So uh, I'm excited to be back and uh, get the things going again. Did you did you think they would keep letting you keep getting through it, or I mean, did that come as a big shock when they told you you weren't going to be scratched? Uh, I mean, it's uh, it's hockey life, right? Uh, I'm not the first one, and I hope, uh, and I think I'm not the last one who you know faces uh, this situation and uh, just the way it is, and just uh, you know, got a heads up and just want to be better. That's a good point. I mean, even in junior or something like that, was that the first time this has ever happened to you in your career? Uh, I mean, uh, when I was back in Czech Republic, I uh, probably s happened to me probably twice, I guess, uh, uh, when I played uh, the men's league. But uh, this is the first time in a while. But uh, as I said, like, it's, uh, it's hockey life. And I'm not the first one and last one who, you know, uh, who's, who's in this situation. So uh, it just kind of, uh, it's hockey. Sounds good. Thanks, Philip. All right, that's all the time we have with Philip today. Thanks, everyone, for joining us.